Number 99. Which of the following molecules have dipole moments? And then we have CLNO, where N is the central atom. Okay, so what is a dipole moment? A dipole moment is when you have an unequal distribution of electrons across the entire molecule, meaning that one side of the molecule might be pulling, think of like tug of war, it's pulling towards one side and the electrons are not basically shared evenly around the whole molecule. So if you think about it in terms of like tug of war, where one team is technically pulling the rope away from the other team. So that's basically what a dipole moment is, but instead of a rope, it's electrons. And you can only have a dipole moment if your molecule is polar. So we basically just have to figure out if this molecule is polar. And if it's polar, it's gonna have a dipole moment. So think dipole, P-O-L, P-O-L. If you are non-polar, you have no dipole. And think of SNAP, S-N-A-P. Symmetrical molecules are non-polar, but if you have that asymmetry, you have that unequal pole, that's polar. So, Basically, if you're trying to figure out dipole moments, the easiest thing to do is to just draw the Lewis structure. Then you can visualize what's actually going on, um, and then you can make your answer from there. Now, in this case, we did tons of videos uh, just figuring out how to draw the Lewis structures, so this one will kind of be like a quick inversion. You could always pause the video and see if your answer matches mine. Now, they did tell us that nitrogen is the central atom. So between Cl, N, and O, nitrogen is in the middle, surrounded by the chlorine and the oxygen. Now in order to make this work, chlorine has seven valence electrons, so it uses one to make a bond, and the other ones are used for um, the octet rule. Oxygen has a double bond with uh, four electrons because oxygen has a total of six valence electrons. So these two, four, six. And then nitrogen has one lone pair. Now, for SNAP, always think of symmetry. If you're breaking this compound right down the middle, we say to ourselves, does, does the left side equal the right side? And everything's got to be equal. Um, we're talking about Atoms, right? Ma mainly it's always going to be the atoms. But on the left side, I see that I have a chlorine. And on the right side, I see that I have an oxygen. This is not symmetrical. This is asymmetrical, right? There is no symmetry here because you don't even have the same atoms on the left and the right side. So this is asymmetrical. And because it's asymmetrical, we know that this is a polar molecule. And because it's polar, we know that it has a dipole moment. All polar molecules will have a dipole moment. Dipole moment. So this answers this question of yes, this one, CLNO, does have a dipole moment. And that's it. How about that? Short and sweet, right to the point. I hope this helped. Thank you for viewing the video. Subscribe to the channel if you want to help us out. I look forward to helping you with more questions. And let me know how you're doing. All right, let me know how you're doing in your classes. And good luck on all your tests and quizzes, not just in chem, but any other class that you're taking, history, foreign language, math. By the way, we also have a lot of math videos and physics videos on the channel as well. So go check them out. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.